Since the dawn of recorded time, the forces of good and evil have struggled for supremacy over planet Earth, each trying to win mortal souls for their respective masters. In the democratic age, the two sides, darkness and light, decided to settle the argument once and for all by means of an election. Each side chose a candidate to represent the fundamental opposing forces of the universe. Champions both locked forever in a bitter embrace, doomed through their lifetimes to embody either yin or yang, male or female, right or left, dry or wet, warm or cold. How's it been going, man? Fairly quiet. And you? About the same. Well, I guess just another epic struggle between good and evil. What's up? Well, I'm fed up of this mortal combat with you, Ray. You know, we go back a long way. Why can't we just be friends? We are friends. Remember, in politics, your friends are always on the other side. Your enemies, they're behind you, mate. I know, but just lately it all seems to be getting a bit predictable. I mean, look at these two, for example. My name is Gwyneth Evans and over the next three days I'll be bringing you coverage from the 12th annual Sheep Music Festival from Prestine Powys. The festival is one of Wales' hidden gems, offering up world roots and rock music set in the most stunning scenery. The festival is still regarded Cut. by... Cut! What? You should have turned left back there. Back where? Oh, honestly, Di, let's find the bloody place first. We can do the intro a bit later. All right, whatever. It's pretty just to be a load of hippies sat around playing Tibetan nose flutes and smoking joysticks. I really thought we were going to get to do Glastonbury this year. I don't understand you sometimes. I thought you were into music. There's some amazing bands on cheap music. Bands you don't get to see anywhere else. <laughs> There's no one ever heard of them.
You're no fun anymore, Green. You used to be fun, do you know? Now all you do is moan. I'm not moaning, Di. All I'm saying is we need to start caring for each other and the planet. And that means thinking about how we're going to make the world a better place. Not just getting pissed. Gwen, we're here to make a youth TV oh. programme for Channel Pedro Cymru. Kids want to see fun, drug fuel madness, that kind of thing. Hippie girls' tits. I think you'll find that our viewers are more interested in world music than they are in hippie girls' tits. Have you ever actually watched television, Gwen? <sighs> Passes and wristbands, please. Oh, uh, hello. We're here from Shana Pedwa Cymru to cover the festival. A groundbreaking youth programme, do we? Yeah, to show the kids getting down to some low-down, dirty fun. But I still need to see your passes. Right. Got passes, Dad? No, we haven't got passes. What do we need passes for? This is my pass. Sorry, lads. <laughs> The office is supposed to organise this last week, actually. <laughs> Did you email the festival with us? It's not my bloody job to sort these things out, woman. I'm the director, not the freaking office dog's body. <sighs> what about then, then? Well, they're our core voters, aren't they? He is quite clearly the bad boy. She is quite clearly the good girl. And as usual, it's just all black and white, you know? It's just going to come down to a handful of floating voters. Come on, Cosmo. Never say die. I bet you I can turn that girl evil. Well then, I bet you I can turn that bad boy good. OK. Let's bet. What's the stake? Well, how about the loser takes the winner to the hat shop restaurant in Prestige. You're on. But who will be the judge? <sighs> what about that compare? He seems above corruption. It's a deal. We're going to have our work cut out, though. Certainly are. You know, I think we need a bit of help on this. I invoke the seven deadly sins, the devil's angels to help me with my task. Come with me, Yeah, yeah, Ray, come on, but since good is always better than evil, I'm only going to need four angels to help me out. The four cardinal virtues. Come to me, forces of good! <sighs> well, another day, back to business as usual, I suppose. I'll see you on the other side. Not if I see you first. I can't wait to get out of my tiny head. Wallow in a little excess. Sex, drugs and rock and roll. Why does it always have to be sex? Have you forgot me about love? And although there's nothing wrong with mild intoxicants in small measure, why do you have to get out to tip your head? And as for rock and roll, they all want to be good nowadays. The lead singer of Raise the Light, right? We certainly give the leaders the free world something to think about. Bollocks! Why can't you separate love from desire, from carnal lust? And why not sail with me on the wild chores of a drug-induced euphoria? I think you are really horrible. <laughs> and I still think you're no fun. Right, are we ready? Yeah. Welcome to Sheet Music 2005. This is one of the few UK festivals that has somehow managed to remain free of the corporate influence that now taints most other gigs of this scale. Sheep music attracts some of the most exciting and diverse performers the world has to offer. This year's eclectic lineup includes from Australia, the Cat Empire, fresh from Live 8, Senegal's Modjadjur, plus the Klezmer 
Tango Crossover of Scotland's Moishas Bago. I'm Gwyneth Evans and I'll be here for the duration, singing you highlights in the shows, exclusive interviews with the band, and we'll also be getting out and about to see what the audience thinks of it. Meanwhile, here's a taster of what's to come. ultimate battle between good and evil. It certainly is. Fancy your chances? We have a great mortal champion. Folks round here call him Dirty Ray. Dirty by name, dirty by nature. You. Cosmic Smiles is our mortal champion for good. He's a beautiful and who's on your spiritual coaching staff? Let me introduce the ladies and gentlemen of evil. We have avarice, gluttony, envy, All right. wrath, lust, sloth, and of course, yours truly, Lucifer the Light Bringer. I, I represent Right. Nice. What about Yao? Oh, we're a very mixed team. We come from all over. We've got wisdom. Ha! We don't stand a chance against wisdom. We've got blind justice. What chance has sin against justice? Who said that? And we have courage. And then there's me. I'm Saint Augustine. And I represent temperance. Temperance? Yes. Moderation. Less of your sex and your drugs and your rock and roll. Moderation and sheet music. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. I think we have found the chink in their defences. <laughs> we shall see, old Lucifer. Pride comes before a fall. I expect that lust has been tempting the young into lascivious ways. No, my fate is a strange one. There is one here called the Compare. He is the returning officer, and as such is supposed to be impartial. I will try and tempt him towards evil. I will be relentless. I will follow him round wherever he so goes, wearing stockings, rubber wear, and I will rub my delicious body against his until he yields. Goodness. I've got hot oil, spiky boots, and a PVC nurse's uniform. I'd like to see the compare resist that. I'll do anything, me. Well, I hate to be the one to break up the party, but we must report to our mortal champion, Dirty Ray, and forge our battle plans. Come! That reminds me. 
Cosmic will be expecting us for herbal teas and chats. Okay, so here we are with Pete Smith, one of the festival organisers. And everybody here seems to be having a really good time, Pete. What do you think is the value of such a, such a festival as this? Oh, we'll cut that again. We'll cut that. <laughs> Move on, we'll cut that. What do you think is the value of, of Sheep Music Festival? It depends how you look at it. I mean, 45 quid for the weekend is incredibly cheap for yeah. what you get. I mean, yeah. There's a huge amount of education, workshops, music, way of life, new ethos and how to look at things. So do you find there's loads of young people here? Do you find they're very well behaved? They're just into the, the, the sort of music and the, 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 the atmosphere that you soak up in this festival? Uh, yeah, totally. They, um, I mean, they build it. The kids build the site. They yeah. build the whole thing. They generate it and then they party for two, wait, two, two days and they clear up. You know, and uh, Without them, it wouldn't happen. They do it. It's part of their culture. 14 years on, most of the people now working here were babies when it started. Well, brilliant, and thanks very much for talking to us, and I hope it goes well every year. <laughs> All right. Okay, band, let's cook it up. I see the flowers, I feel the grass, I see the rivers floating past. I know that everything's gonna work out fine I know the sun is just gonna shine Move on up to a brighter day Do you want to say Let's anything? Hold hands. Oh, I'll lead the way oh, this is Shout it out, Hello, you know Lauren. you should I feel good Good boy, how old are you, Thorin? At the clear blue sky Big boy! And do you like sheet music? What have you done so far? Human race. We can make Do this matter a brighter place. Okay. Move on up to a brighter day. Come on, let's hold hands. You lead the way. Shout oh my God, this you is know awesome. Just come in, big guys. I feel good. Oh, okay. 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 So, what do you reckon is the best thing about you? about the outcome of the election. Remember, Ray, you are the man. You are the M-A-N. That's what you are, man. Yes, get out there and crush those so-called forces of good like insects under your thumb. And if we win, we'll be giving you a big tax-free cash bonus. Unmarked notes. I 
dinner for two at the Stag Inn at Titley. Now don't want cosmic smiles to win, do you? Look at him, he's all tall and blonde and beautiful. Then best to get there. Shut up! Way range and hippie wire. Remember, good will always climb through the evil. Be wise, oh colourful trousered one. Remember, wisdom destroys ignorance. Be just, golden tressed ambassador of peace. Remember, injustice cannot be allowed to prevail. Yes, quite right. But don't anyone overdo it. Aren't you a deadly sin short? Where's Lust? Don't worry, Ray. She's gone off to tempt the compare. It's like the returning officer. When she's finished with him, he'll be like putty in our hands. <laughs> I'm still a bit nervous about the outcome of the election, though. Don't worry. The compare is the acting returning officer for the constituency of sheep music. I will send him wisdom and blind justice. And when he sees their combined charms, he's sure to call the election for us. Is that proper? The young people who are called upon to vote are bound to be a bit biased in favour of evil. We'll say it was the postal vote or something. Do not fear. We will win. Yes. More tea, anyone? Where did you meet them and what have you been doing? Mm, playing. Yeah. And playing. What sort of stuff have you been getting up to, girls? Um, <laughs> um, getting wasted. Yeah. Two days straight. Yeah. We're going to have a wander around and see what's going on. Have a laugh. Get wrecked. <laughs> We'll be on TV. There's going to be an election, and I would like you to vote for good. Oh. Because good is good at the end of the day. Shano Pedro Company um, for the Youth Movement to this. And we're wondering if you could tell us. Um, you know, what you think is so good about this festival? It's uh, just time for everyone to have a good time, isn't it? And have a laugh. We get natural things in Welsh talent, like, you know what I mean? Excellent. Yeah. People showing what they can do. Yeah. Nice weather, like, so time for everyone to have a good time, isn't it? Can we ask you a few questions, please? Yeah. Oh, you are, believe me. The festival, I think. 
at the moment I think it's quite cool. There's quite a few good shops as well and the, the food bar down there is really, really relaxing. It's called Moonfish or something. Yeah, well, why do you, why, what is it about cheap music that really, you know, Drugs, Dyke, well, drugs, fucking out, drugs, 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 drug
the only music you'll be allowed to listen to. Cliff Richard and Evanescence. Your sex life will dwindle away to nothing because the only people you'll be able to sleep with are your lawfully married spouses. And how dull would that be? You won't even be able to go on the internet and crack one off. Imagine! But picture, if you will, a world that is run by evil. Every evening, drunken debauchery to the searing rock music. A bacchanalian orgy every afternoon with lesbian action a lot. And of course, a lie-in every morning. And who better to represent the power of evil than our own, our very own, Dirty Ray? He is a truly vile individual whose life of whoring, drugs, general excess make him entirely suitable for a career of evil. As a child, he stuck Lego up his dog's ass. <laughs> As a teenager, he was a prestigious disciple of honor. In his early 20s, on the road with kick-ass rock and roll bands, he liked nothing better than to snort coke off the paps of young ladies, girls of the night. And that's where all his hard-earned money went. With evil in control and Dirty Ray at the helm, I can assure you of a future which is jam-packed with indulgence and degradation. Therefore, ladies and gentlemen, I urge you to vote evil! has told you something of his vision of a future controlled by evil. Now, it certainly has its attractions. 
In my youth, I led a most rackety existence. The idea of drunken whoring certainly appealed most strongly. And there are times, even now, when I fancy going out on the lash with my pals, or losing myself in the fleshy delights of some little strumpet, or sucking some big spliff, or better still, driving my great 4x4 four four at breakneck speed through the back lanes of Radish. But, 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 as is his wont, Lucifer has painted only a partial picture of evil. But I ask you, was Pol Pot naughty? Was Adolf Hitler a bit of a scamp? Or was that Rwanda thing just a drunken spree that got out of hand? No. They are the true images of a world controlled by the forces of darkness. And let no one tell you that a world controlled by good would have no fun in it. Mild intoxicants would still be allowed, as would heavy petting. And what is wrong with Sir Cliff Richard or Evanescence? Well, Sir Cliff, anyway. I still quite like his first album. Our candidate today is Cosmic Smiles, a lovely man. When he was a child, he didn't penetrate household pets with plastic toys. And he didn't spend his teenage years beating his meat over a tatty old copy of Razzle. Right, maybe he did, but he's just human. And since going to the Windsor Free Festival in 1974, he has devoted his life to peace and love. Just look at him. Isn't he beautiful? Contrast that with Dirty Ray. He's so weak. Look for yourselves. The benefits of a life given over to the cause of good. Go on. Vote for good. So sad, things just went from worse to bad. The earth is fucked and fear is in town. Yeah, me love as you all go down. Your smelly tea and wear your eco-friendly shoes You eat organic greens but you don't touch booze You might as well go and piss in the wind Cause this stinking little planet is about to get bin. is a 
of good I'd rather team up with a plank of wood Festival is about far more than just music. It's also about alternative lifestyles. There are many organic, ecological skills being demonstrated. For example, in this wood fired pizza exhibition, die! God, I've had enough of this! What's the man? Hang on, we still got stuff to shoot in the acoustic tent! rising in your lungs. When I touched you here and nibbled you here and talked to you in my PVC nurse's uniform, couldn't you feel the movement in your chakras? You must trust that movement. You should tap into that energy. You've got to let yourself go live a little. Why are you so buttoned up? Look, gaze into the immensity of my milky paps and yield to your desires. You should trust that desire. And when the time has come for the election to be called, all you have to do is make sure that evil wins. And then you can lose yourself in me. I am woman, all woman. Listen to my womanly wisdom and come on to me. Last year, don't mind my saying so, 11 months pregnant. I am fecund. I'm heavy with desire for your manhood. I've got a stirrup pump and 10 metres of plastic sheeting. Oh, oh. Which would be lovely. But I've got to call the election fairly. Everyone's relying on me. I'm going to have to pass. <laughs> you may say that now, but no man can pass on lust. You'll see the truth of what I've said, mortal. Ooh. Wisdom. Blind justice. What brings you here? What? Yeah. We've come to remind you of your duties to justice and wisdom. Lust was here, wasn't she? Yes. And was she talking to you about water sports? And did she promise you the thing with the stirrup pump if only you swung a few votes in favour of evil? She did, yes. And did you agree? No. But she did tell me that I would never be able to escape from lust. If you yield to lust again and again, it becomes a habit and quickly destroys health and spirit. Your body will become weak and feeble. Excessive cases have led to the lunatic asylum. Sometimes desire is brought on by excessively rich food or indigestion or constipation. It is therefore curable by bathing at once in extremely cold water. If you are still troubled, do not make it a secret, but go to your scoutmaster and talk it over with him and all will come well. My scoutmaster. That's what it says in Scouting for Boys. A very wise book. But I'm not in the scouts. I'm 47. Well then, you're too old to be bothered by lust. And you're wise enough to know to call the election in favour of good. You're asking me to call the election in your favour? I'm not. You must do what you feel is right.
enjoy yourself? Yes. Um, I haven't really been watching the band so much this year. It's just generally partying. Uh, it's been very good. I really enjoyed the Maroon Train last night. Yeah, they're really good. The festival's got a great atmosphere. Loads of people loving it, enjoying it. What have we loved? Um, what was that by CCQ? CCQ. Um, CCQ were brilliant. Maroon Town. And Maroon Town, I think it's fair to say we fell in love with the singer. <laughs> he was nice. We just did good loving. Yeah. I enjoyed the queue. Have you seen any action, girls? Everybody sees, seems to think, to, well, to believe, right? There's drinking allowed on site. I'm not so sure about it. You're right, lads. Yeah, this is us living at large. It's a bit sunny. I've got a bit of sunburn on my nose, but I'll touch the fluffy enough. thing. Yeah, I'll leave it out, leave it out. Don't try to interview us. Yeah. It's, it's like the first one, mate. You go past that one, you go to the second one. Hey, pal. Trying to get home. Hey, pal. How's it going, pal? So, what are you doing? You look like you're having a fantastic time. What's this? It's a skirt. Oh, really? Have you modeled it for us? Yeah. Not finished yet, though. Look at that. So you just made that now, did you? Yes, yeah, it's my outfit tonight. Oh, there's a man behind the camera. Let's throw the water bomb at him. Well, you better not, like. You, you better not. Shall I do it? Right. Hey, 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 watch it. The camera's expensive.
making love to your old lady. Why are you out making love? Ladies and gentlemen, it's now the moment when we need you to choose between good and evil. If you could please hold up your cards now. My God. Oi. It's close. As acting returning officer for the constituency of the Sheet Music Festival in the election between the forces of good and evil, I hereby announce that, taking into account the postal vote, ladies and gentlemen, the result. It's a dead heat! No! I demand a recount! Yes, I would like one, if it's not too much trouble. has been telling me that I need to yield to my desires. Wisdom and blind justice tell me that I should be wise and just. But if I listen to the wisdom of lust, I realise that I fancy the pants of these little minxes, the goddesses of wisdom and blind justice. Yes, I can be both wise and just and yet yield to my desires. This must mean that both good and evil are different sides of the same coin. We need both in order to be fully alive. So true wisdom lies in a marriage of the opposing forces. Yes. yes. Does this mean I have to marry Cosmic Smiles? Yes. Everyone who is evil must marry someone who's good. Right here and now. And then the world will be mended. Cosmic. Hey. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to celebrate the marriage between the forces of good and the forces of evil. Forces of good, take evil to be your lawfully wedded on the half. We do! Forces of evil. <laughs> do you take the forces of good to be your lawfully wedded on the half? We and thus are reunited after all time. The forces of good and the forces of evil. I know pronounce.
galaxy. Dark and light, Alpha and Omega, man and wife, yin and yang, dry and wet, you may all kiss. Another episode in the struggle between good and evil has reached its conclusion. Cosmic Smiles and Dirty Ray are very happy and run a small antique shop in Bridge North. Di and Gwyneth are working for a youth TV channel in Patagonia. Nast gave birth to a spooky baby which Saint Augustine has adopted as his own. Sadly, wisdom ran off with Lucifer. Blind Justice is still happily married to the compere. Tell me again what you look like. Like a cross between Iggy Pop and George Clooney. I must be the luckiest immortal alive. Hmm. 